stop falling for this and stop taking the bait. Hey, my name's Al, and I see 3D artists, myself included, falling for this trap all of the time. This trap is called shiny object syndrome. Here's an example. Let's say you want to work as a character artist at Disney. Now, I'm proud of you because you have a pretty specific goal, and most people don't even have that. Now, you've been honing your skills, getting better and better at sculpting stylized characters in Blender that might mesh well with Disney's style. But then Blender launches, insert new feature here, geometry notes, for example. Your YouTube feed is filled with thousands of tutorials and different artworks the creators are just pumping out using this super cool feature. So neurons fire in your brain and you get this warm fuzzy feeling and you dive headfirst in creating and learning this brand new tool. You convince yourself by saying things like, ah, it'll just be another tool in my tool belt. It'll make my resume look even better. But there's a problem. You see the new thing sparkle in the water and like a fish, you go for it. You're then snagged hook, line, and sinker and being dragged in the opposite direction of your goals and ultimately your dreams. Now some of you might say, well, what's the problem? What's the big deal? I'm still in Blender. It's just a slight deviation. So I have a question for you. Is learning this new thing, whatever it is, geometry nodes or whatever, this new thingamajig, is it helping you achieve your goals? Will this new feature or software be used enough in your pipeline? Maybe, but if we go back to our example of a character artist, probably not. So more than likely you will spend hours upon hours learning how to do this new thing, practicing this new thing, only to use it for one project and never touch it again. Or you learn how to do the thing and you use it once in a blue moon and then when you want to do that thing again you have to relearn parts or all of it all over. You are literally wasting your time away when you could be spending that time reaching for your goals and your aspirations. So stay on track and keep the course and if you need help staying on track watch this video.